You have all gotten candy or maybe a soda from a vending machine, but how about ammunition? Well, that is the reality up in Canyon Lake as the first ammo vending machine in Texas has been placed in our area. Fox SA's Matt Roy explains. You heard that right, an ammunition vending machine. And while many Canyon Lake residents are pleased at its placement and that it's here making ammo more available, there's also many on the other side of that concerned that the first ammunition vending machine in the state of Texas will help ammo get into the wrong hands. I cannot imagine anyone thinking this is a good idea. I think it's a good idea. Not everyone's on board with the American Rounds ammunition vending machine at the Lowe's Market on Sattler Road in Canyon Lake. But according to the American Round CEO, Grant Majors, this doesn't work like any old vending machine. This is a video they posted on their website. You can see here we have, you know, a very secure automated retail machine. We're able to age verify. We scan a driver's license. It then takes 360 facial recognition for the purchase and matches it to the ID. Much different than just putting in your dollar in the machine dropping out your chosen delight. However, it's not just the increased availability of ammo that's a concern to some. It's also the fact that this machine is in a store that's located less than 200 yards from a middle school. There are literally every day after school children hanging out in that parking lot, going in to buy snacks. It, it's just extra disturbing to me that it's in a place where children have direct access to it. Speaking with employees at the market today, they said the machine was put in because that's what their clientele is interested in. And most of the people I spoke to today feel the exact same way. I enjoy shooting. I'm a Texan. I think everybody should have the right to buy guns and ammo if they, if they license for it and everything. We reached out to the owner of Lowe's Market today, but did not get a response. Matt Roy, Fox News at 9. Several